France is fitting Paseo XLR EO slash IR system on all its Frem and air defense destroyers. In response to the escalating threat posed by Kamikaze Unmanned Surface Vehicles, USV, and Unmanned Air Vehicles, UAV, the French Navy has issued an urgent operational requirement to fit Safran Electronics and Defense's Paseo XLR Extra Long Range Naval Optronic Identification and Fire Control System on all its first rank vessels. The move is a direct retex, return of experience, of the situation in the Red Sea. The repeated Houthi rebels attacks prompted the swift response to enhance the defense capabilities of the Frem frigates and Forbin class destroyers. The information first surfaced in late February during a media briefing with Alexander Lahus, head of the Industrial Affairs and Economic Intelligence Department, S2IE, at the French Defense Procurement Agency, DGA, we are going to install electro-optic gimbals on our frigates, they will help with detection, identification and adaptation of the response when our ships are facing various threats. Lahus added this is a direct return of experience from current situation in the Red Sea. A prototyping was conducted in December on of the frigates now deployed there and the DGA signed a contract in February to equip all frigates. Lahus concluded, highlighting it took just three months to award the contract to Safran. Lahus confirmed to Naval News Nathan Gain that the system in question is the Paseo XLR by Safran Electronics and Defense. Naval News understands that the first Frem frigate to receive the Paseo XLR is the first of the air defense variant, Frem DA, Alsace, D656. The frigate joined the Red Sea in January 2024. Safran fitted the Paseo XLR system over the winter break, between Christmas and New Year, in record time. Meanwhile, on March 9, 2024, the French Air Defense Frigate destroyed a number of UAVs using its 76mm main gun. This was likely a first as previous engagements by both Languedoc, which has been deployed on location since the end of November but just came back to her home port in Toulon, and Alsace involved Aster missiles. The destruction of the UAVs by gunfire was likely possible, or at least eased, thanks to the Paseo XLR, and the stir fire control radar fitted on both Frem DA ships. Toulon-based ship spotter Hervé Dermoun recently spotted Alsace's sister ship, Lorraine, D657, fitted with the Paseo XLR. The system is fitted on top of the helicopter hangar. Specifically designed for operations in extreme naval environments, Paseo XLR comprises a high-performance gyro-stabilized platform providing an accurate line of sight, a wide set of imagers with continuous zoom and high-power telescopes, and an eye-safe laser rangefinder. Paseo XLR allows manual or automatic sector surveillance, automatic target tracking, visual identification, laser ranging, and transmission or reception of 3D target data. When fitted with its optional ballistic computer, Paseo XLR is able to simultaneously control several guns of different calibers to ensure high-accuracy gun firing. Integrated into a combat management system or operated in a standalone mode, Paseo XLR allows manual or automatic sector surveillance, automatic target tracking, visual identification, and transmission or reception of 3D target designation information. Paseo XLR can simultaneously control several guns of different calibers. Paseo XLR is currently fitted on the Philippine Navy's frigates, and upcoming corvettes, built by Hyundai Heavy Industries and on the Indian Navy aircraft carrier Vikrant.